Greetings, traveler. Hi. Oh, hello, adventurer. Please take a look around. I'm sure you'll find something to your liking. How many customers do you get here? No? Do you get many customers here? Do I have to hold a button first? Do you get many customers here? Do I have to hold a button? Oh. Son of a... That you one. Told you're the first one. You haven't seen anyone around here yet, have you? I'll keep an eye out. No, am I forgetting how the voice activation works? I don't know. Well, customers, goblins. But there are much worse things in this mine if the stories are true. It said the miners flooded this place before they left and trapped most of it inside. You know, I'm curious. The game, as far as I'm aware, doesn't have like a, a mic setting. So I'm curious if the game is defaulting to my Blue Yeti. Alright, Blue Yeti's on. What kind of things were the miners trying to trap? Well, I've seen some awfully big spider webs, but I doubt that's the worst of it. Whatever lies on the other end of the tunnel under the water in the main cavern is probably much worse. So the the game defaulted my microphone to my blue yeti, so it's not listening to me through my headset. And I don't believe the game has any microphone settings. No, it doesn't. So currently I actually cannot fix it unless I basically I close the game or something and then default my headset mic to my default mic and then restart the game. Great. What do you think is at the other end of that tunnel? Don't know. Don't care to know if I'm honest. Just thinking about it makes my skin crawl. Is there anything else I can help you with? Yeah, how did you get here? <laughs> yes, actually, how did you get here? That's a good question. You're clever to ask. I think it's common sense to ask. Oh, what? He just stared at me in silence and there's a fucking earthquake? Alright, keep your fucking you secrets. There, adventurer. Now do come back if you find yourself in need of some new equipment. I'll be here. Great. Hello, adventurer. Hello! Alright, so. Salvage metal here. Known recipes. Place a recipe here to get started. I have recipe. The light bringer. It's the opposite of dark. That requires 200 iron. I have 60. Fuck, salvage metal here. Can I can I give you a sword? Twenty iron for the default sword. Can I give you my bow? It's not made of metal, but I don't want it. It has, it has probably a little bit of metal on it somewhere. No? Okay. What about an arrow? Can I give you an arrow? No? Oh, fuck you too, buddy. What about a bomb? You want a bomb? You cannot melt it down. Well, fuck you. Well, it looks like I'm gonna need a lot more iron before I can actually make this thing, which has a base damage of 22. I don't know what my sword has, but uh, let's look at what you got, buddy. The devs were telling me about this meteor shard life steal. I can put life steal instead of that fire effect on my sword, and when I dual wield, I can have like two of these and go like full on Kirito, just full DPS with no regard for my life. And I want it, but it's 500. Exquisite sword, 2,500, and it does 18 damage. Well, that's probably better than this, but it's not as good as that. But I can afford it, and only it. Now, here's something I don't want. I could sell, right? 250 gold for mana steel. Yeah, take it. Can I sell you a bomb? Fuck. Why does nobody want bombs? These are very effective. You want an apple? <laughs> uh, I guess you do, a little. 
take take the apple. I don't want the apple. I never use it. I kind of just want to make this, but I don't have the iron for it. I can't buy iron, apparently. So, I think I'm... Oh, wait. <gasps> can I sell my bow? Oh, I can sell the bow for a hundred. Dude, fucking go ahead. I don't, I don't even want it. Can I sell you the arrows? I don't think I can sell the arrows, but I can sell the bow. Alright, I'm fine with that. That's... Because I'm never going to use it. It sucks. I wish I knew how much damage my sword did, but regardless, this will be better. Again, not as good as this, but I can afford this, and it will help me. Oh, it hurts. It hurts my very soul. And now we're gonna grab this bad boy. And we're gonna... Haha! <laughs> Alright, a stronger sword with lifesteal. Wait, where'd my other sword go now? Oh, I still have it. Base damage 10. That sucks. Holy shit. That's actual garbage in comparison. Even this is loads better. 14, 18, yeah. That 22 is fucking over twice the damage as this. I guess I'll just hold on to this for the time being. Melt it down once I need to. Yeah. Alright. I think that's all my money. So, uh... Oh, speaking of all my money... Thank you, game. What? I, I'm, I'm mining over here. What's the matter with you? Come on. Son of a bitch. Listen here. I'll have you know I'm the sh strongest gold miner in the Wild West. You, you fucker. Thank you. Do you have any iron though? Ooh, a mana potion. Fuck. Ma mana potion. I could start. Wait. I, wait. I could sell these. I'm starting to get a number of them and I don't use them because I rely on my sword more than anything. And there's no quick way to use one either. You have to drag out your backpack, then take one out, and then use it, during which time your mana's already. Regenerating anyway. Alright, so we found another. So I could see an enemy. Ah. Uh, definitely haven't been over there yet. Interesting. I don't know if they've ever seen that you can do that. The devs. You can't do it on every wall. But on some of them you can, and I just happen to be finding them. Oh, actually, you can do it over here, too. Another enemy. And that looks vaguely like where I just came from. Yeah, there's random, like, earthquakes in this that vibrate your controller. And it's really concerning as a PC player who's not used to my shit vibrating. So when I was a kid, and I used to do, like, the little rock climbing things that they always had at, like, I don't know, carnivals or some shit? I don't even know where. But, uh, I always sucked at it. I'd always get up to, like, a certain part, and then I'd notice the rocks were all just so spaced out, and I never knew how to go next, or I couldn't reach it, so I'd always have to stop then and there, and just kind of fall back. I'm so glad that you can't... can't do that here. Oh, son of a bitch. Oh, bye! I hate slidey colliders. That's a slidey collider. And I, I don't have grit. Anyone else? He looks like he's in a pretty shitty position. Alright. Hey, buddy. You're next. Ah, oh, son of a! Oh, the sword just healed me! <laughs> That's awesome! And I could tell it's a sword because the ooh is a lot quieter. I'm still getting shot at, and I'm over here like, Oh, my sword healed me! How cool!
<sighs> Fuck, they're everywhere, dude. Hate goblins. Why? Why does this evil world destroying mastermind only have goblins? By the way, goblins are usually like the weird, the weakest possible fantasy creatures ever. Them and rats are always the first. Ooh, always the first enemy. Here, oh, I know. Here we have spiders, but everything has spiders. Hello, side area. Oh, there's water! I can fall into. Oh, okay. Wait, I, I, there's water I can move through. Holy shit! I thought they all had like invisible walls and shit. Okay. Come to me, fruit of Adam, or or wait, Eve, or I don't know. It's time. Oh wait, that's the health one. All right. Well, I'll take it. All right. Now we go further into our gobliny abyss. I don't know what this little area. Whatever happened to that fucking skeleton with the sword back there? We never actually went down to it. Hmm. You know, I don't know. That was just so weird. It makes me feel like I'm missing something because I don't think we're going down, are we? We're, we're going up. This game has a way of taking you roundabout quite a bit. Yeah, but look, we I just went up. Whatever happened to that sword? Hmm. I'm gonna investigate. Whatever's down here, the devs really don't want you to get down there, it seems like. Although, I got- I- uh, I am just so fucking curious. Like, I can't help but come back here and try to want to know what the hell that guy's holding and what he's saying. Well, maybe if I reach the, the rock. Fuck. Come on, give, give me the rock. Give me- give me the rock. Eh. There is a sword there, you son of a bitch. And I demand that you hand it to me. It's funny how much faster you can go if you try. The game gives you a really safe path, but you can really rush climbing shit if you want. You know, climbing stuff in this game, it feels like swimming. But I don't know how to swim. 